Hi, hi, hi. So you've made that decision to sign up to the five day challenge. So with four plus tips for beginners. Okay, so welcome, welcome. So for those who don't know me, my name's Fiona, so a big welcome. And just a little bit of background about me. I've been teaching for years and years, too many years. Uh, so you're looking probably about 17, 18 years and I teach a variety of fitness, but my main areas, what I tend to focus on more is Pilates and yoga. So the main thing for you then is Pilates. So if we don't know what Pilates is, which hopefully when you've done the five days, you'll understand more about Pilates and how it's functional and will make it work for every day. Yep, so basically Pilates is a powerhouse. So round to the core and back, that's what we class as a powerhouse, yeah? So we're all focused round here, core and back. And then what we're trying to do is make it more functional with everyday moves. So if we're going forward, we class that, so there's three planes. So forward is your front row. Then we've got lateral to the side, so we've got to lean to the side, so we're always working through the core and back. Then you've got the transverse or reverse, so if you're going to put a seatbelt on and you're getting that turn, yeah? So we've got, you've got the forward, you've got the side, and then you've got the rotation back, yeah? Or you've got the reverse where you're just leaning back and you get that little arch into your back. So there will be all different levels, so please do not panic. I'll talk you through them. So some of you I have spoken to or messaged um, to say that if you've got any back problems, knee problems, wrist, anything like that, to let me know, yeah? So I will give you different levels. Obviously, this is going to be slightly different because we're working online. Usually, I work in the community. I have been finding, I've been running groups online and they've been going really, really well and people are really enjoying them. So this is something because we can't get into the gym yet. We don't know where it's going to uh, open with a H then open then that's what we're going to do we're bringing it all online and i'm just going to guide you through them so hopefully then you'll start to see and understand what pilates is about so we'll do it nice and basic you'll still get to sweat on you still work even though you think oh this might start off a bit easy and then slowly i'll just up it up for you so i will put a disclaimer in the group so today is sunday so you will all be coming in slowly and then we kick off on monday what I'll probably do is put in the first workout late on Sunday night, ready for Monday. So if you get any of those early starters who'd like to get up, ideally, if you can do it first thing in the morning, set you off brilliantly. The workouts will be about 10 to 15 minutes. So you'll have the choice of if you want to do it twice or three times, if you've got that time, then why not? Why not do it, yeah? So you just work at your own pace, yes? So they're all pre-recorded. And what I do say is try and make sure you just do a little warm up before you start the videos. So then you're not getting me warming you up all the time and missing out of it. So it just makes it little short blocks. So you can do some marching on the spots, some rotations, some little twists. I will do on the first workout, I will include a warm up, just a gentle warm up. So then you know what to do and then you can just crack onto it. So I do make sure, I do want to advise it, you just do a little warm up and then same with the cool down. We'll do a little stretch, but if you want to stretch out a bit more, then add on double up the stretches. Yes. Okay. So in the group, what I want you to do is one most important thing is when you go into WhatsApp, for those who are doing WhatsApp, turn off your notifications in case in my other group the messages are going off ping ping all the time so if you put it on silent or you can mute it then you can still see them coming through but it'll be silent in the background and your phone won't be pinging all the time so that is your first thing number two i need you to communicate with me in the group so let me know how you're feeling did you enjoy the workout did you feel any discomfort anything like that if it is on a personal note and you do think you're having problems with something and you don't want to share it with everybody, just send me a private message, not a problem. But do give me feedback because then I know what's working and how I can help and tweak it around for you, yes? So just, just a couple of things like that. Um, number three, make sure you do have some water, have a drink by the side of you. Make sure as well that you've got a mat, or if not, if you're on the carpet, that's not so bad, you're okay. Or maybe just get a towel, you don't need to have a proper mat. And if you do find, when we do the floor work, 
uh, that your back bone will land on the floor. If it's slightly uncomfortable for your back, just get a cushion or a blanket and just put it into the lower of your back where you feel it's not. So if you do have a curve into your back, just place a towel under it. Just don't make it thick, just so then you can just feel it touching and it'll give you a bit more padding and support. So I hope you'll enjoy these five days. Um, so again, any feedback, um, if you need to know anything else, please do drop me a message. Also, on another thing is regarding the breathing side of it, I won't go too deep into it. So I will talk you through the breathing while we're doing the exercises. The main thing is because you're new to it, I don't want to bore you with the breathing. As long as you're breathing, that's all I ask for. But the breathing is thoracic, so through the ribs. So we're opening up, and that's how you do your breathing in through the nose and then out through the mouth, yeah? But if you prefer, and you're used to doing breathing, if you do other exercises, you do it in through your nose, out through your nose, or out, whichever way, I don't mind. As long as you're breathing, that is, that is your number one priority. And then everything else goes next, okay? So I look forward to seeing you on Monday um, in the group. Obviously, I won't see you, but I will drop notes in there, voice notes as well. But just let me know when you've done it, and uh, I hope you enjoy it. So thank you. Bye.